is a story you will see first right here on 2 News. Supportive Services for Veteran Families, or SSVF. It's located in Tulsa. It's getting a lot more funding. That's the good news. But with it, additional territory to help veterans in Oklahoma. It's a goal. Uh, the goal of the organization, I should say, is to help a veteran who is either in a housing crisis, homeless, or facing eviction within 21 days. We first introduced you to SSVF in early August. At that time, the organization, which is a part of the Community Service Council, had a budget of about $2 million, covered 35 counties. Starting this week, SSVF now covers 42 counties, which includes Oklahoma City. The organization is funded through grants, and with this expansion, the budget is now roughly $3.7 million, and that's a lot of money. It's exciting, but the number of families they need to help right now is also much higher. The expectation is here in Tulsa, we are required annually to serve uh, 430 families, and then this will be an addition of another 400 in the, in that area. So it's not, and that's not impossible to do. Unfortunately, there's more than enough people out there to service. It's that's an unfortunate fact, but at least we're here to help. That is Rachel Runfola. She's the program director for SSVF. She says with the expansion into Oklahoma City, the collaboration with the VA will be stronger as well. I think they um, are excited by the prospect of some of the uh, things that we bring to them that have already been tried here and are working really successfully with the VA here in eastern Oklahoma. The eastern um, Oklahoma VA that we work with, the hud -Vash program, has is just an excellent program and we interface really well with them. I think we actually bring an excellent partnership to the area and I think we can grow that in Oklahoma City as well. And the former grant holder in that area has people there. They're going to kind of come into the fold and Runfola says that the veterans in this area will notice some changes as SSVF wants to help veterans not only get into safe housing, but also keep them there, help stabilize them. To learn more about SSVF and how you can get a veteran some help, you can search for this story on the free 2 News app. You can download it from whatever app store you use.